And we begin this morning with the arrest of a failed Republican candidate accused of being the mastermind behind a series of shootings at the homes of Democratic lawmakers. Police took Solomon Pena into custody yesterday, calling the shootings politically motivated. Back in November, Pena lost his race for state representative and complained the election was rigged. Police say he confronted the Democrats at their homes with what he claimed were documents proving he had won his race. And that's when things allegedly took a turn. NBC's Vaughn Hilliard joins us now. Vaughn, what more do we know this morning? Yeah, Jose, as the mayor of Albuquerque said yesterday, this was not only a conspiracy that was dangerous to these individuals, but a conspiracy that was dangerous to democracy here. The prosecutors, a U.S. attorney outlined what they contend and they allege uh, Solomon Pena to be the mastermind of. This is an individual who, to note, he was running for state representative as a Republican, challenging to incumbent Democrat in New Mexico. He lost his November election 74 percent to 26 percent. But in the days after his election defeat, he went to the homes of not only county commissioners, but also state legislators with what he alleged was paperwork showing fraud in his election. He makes the case that his election was rigged. But then days after going and presenting what he claimed to be evidence of the election rigging, uh, he put out on Twitter that he was not going to concede and that he was, quote, now researching my options. Well, prosecutors now outline that in those following days, he conspired and he paid cash money to four other individuals to go and shoot at the homes of two county commissioners and two state legislatures. There were four different days in which the shootings of these homes took place, beginning on December 4th. And then the final incident, that fourth incident, was on January 3rd. And prosecutors allege... Now, Pena himself on that fourth incident went to one of those homes and attempted to fire a weapon himself. Well, that weapon, they say, uh, malfunctioned. And in hours after that, ultimately, the police pulled over a vehicle that was registered to Pena. There was a different driver inside who was arrested. Several weapons were confiscated inside of that vehicle here. But this is a, 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 a serious allegations. And of course, uh, none of those individuals were actually believed to be physically harmed in this incident, yet clearly there was a conspiracy and somebody who was living in a different reality who sought to take measures into his own hands, Jose. Vaughn Hilliard, thank you very much.